Hi everyone, I am from the Scarlet Underground. Uh, I just want to say um, that we are absolutely enthralled with the amount of support that we have gotten from uh, the communities in India and abroad, um, our friends, our comrades, uh, FAU. Uh, and FAU has actually done an amazing job. Uh, my comrades there, they sold their own asparagus to, to grow to, to make make enough money to send to us and that is an amazing um, show of solidarity uh, all of us here who are really happy that that happened and and the fact that the money was made with a lot of labor and love uh, I just want this video this video kind of goes out to all the donors to everyone who has actually um, um, given us some amount of contribution uh, and I just want to make it clear what we are doing uh, in in Jhargram. So I just want to talk about the process basically. So the process is that uh, once we get 10,000 rupees from wherever, uh, we use that money to go to uh, a village community and we ask the people there what they basically need so some people say rice and lentils and dal and whatnot some people say that they don't need rice some um, but rather would rather have potatoes or whatever so basically it depends on the village so we take someone from the community and we buy all the produce that they want with that 10,000 rupees and sometimes more depending on how many people there are and we have the mutual aid drive based on what they want. We don't necessarily do everything ourselves. We include the people from the community in our work. So if we are doing it, uh, when we did it in Postro and Lao Khapra, for example, the people who are giving it out were the people from Postro and Lao Khapra. So the idea is that uh, it's not a show of it's not charity, it's a show of solidarity and the idea is uh, that we are trying to stand with them and not trying to, you know, like impose ourselves on them as some sort of, uh, uh, you know, NGO that's trying to help them and it's more, it's, it's more about being in support of them and making them know that uh, we are with them no matter what so it's it's not just a service it's it's also a show of love so whenever we uh, include them in our actions uh, where they are actually the ones giving the food out to themselves they feel really included in it and more often than not they come back and say that okay like we want to go to another village uh, we'll help you go to another village and uh, let's all do it there again and you know this just working just uh, working for a while in in a project that has something to do with mutual aid just gives you so much uh, joy and and this overwhelming feeling of love and solidarity really just it kind of washes over everyone you know like and people get really into it so you know we have you to be thankful for for this this none of this would have been possible if uh, we didn't have the money for it and the fact that you guys have been there you know with us since the beginning uh it just shows a lot you know it sh shows us so you know like it's just this network of solidarity and it's it's a it's a great feeling and i thank you to, you know every each and every one of you for that uh please um, keep it coming <laughs> because we will try to keep this going for as long as we can at least uh, you know at least for this entire year uh so every time we get about 10000 rupees we will go to another village again right now we are done again we just went to Postro, Lao Khapra and um, Mohul Buni. Uh, those three villages, we spent 10,000 for 125 people. 
um, the next one we are deciding on. Uh, we urge you to uh, contribute if you can. And if things go the way they are, um, we'll be doing this all year. And it's a, it's a great feeling. And none of this would have happened without your help. So thank you.